Good morning, everybody. It's raining today, so I'm going to show you guys how to build with Play-Doh. You might have to go make some Play-Doh with mom and dad. And you have to remember the number one rule when you do Play-Doh at home. My rule is I have to stay at the kitchen counter. Ask mom and dad, where can you do Play-Doh? It might be outside on the front porch. I don't know what your family rule is, but wherever mom and dad say is the Play-Doh station, that's where the Play-Doh stays, all right? Second thing you have to do is go find your stuff. We're gonna make a nature tinker tray today. Go outside and find as many things as you can. I found some rocks, medium rocks, and tiny rocks. I found some acorns. I found a pretty big stick, and I broke it up into a lot of pieces. It was pretty fun breaking sticks. And then I found in our garage these plastic circles that come on drinks. So I'm going to use those to build with. Can you count how many there are right there? One, two, three, four, five, six. And then I cut some up. They're kind of hard to cut, so if you have these, maybe mom or dad could cut them for you. How many on that one? One, two. They come in all different colors. It's pretty cool. How many on this one? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And one all by himself. And the other thing I found, it's not nature-y, but it was shiny. It was this paper that we had in the garage, and you can kind of rip it. So I did that. All right? So if your rocks are really dirty because it's wet, go wash them. Ask mom to give you a pot of water or wash them in the sink and then dry them. You want to dry them really good because the Play-Doh does not necessarily like extra water. Okay, so number one, stay at the Play-Doh station. Number two, gather all your stuff. Sort it. Make it look nice. You know how Mrs. Kelly and Mrs. Conaway and I make art tinker trays? This is our Play-Doh tinker tray. Don't get anything too tiny if you have brothers and sisters that are one and two. We don't want them to swallow them. All right, so now it's time to build. We have our base so we can move it when we're done. So the first thing I'm gonna do is take some Play-Doh, move that so you can see better, and flatten it out. Mine's a little bit dirty already from because I was practicing. But I'm going to put my rock in some Play-Doh. That's my base. Your base is your bottom layer. And now I'm going to take a little bit, make it into a ball. There we go. I'm going to do both sides the same. I'm going to put a stick in there. Watch this. It just stays there. It's so awesome. It's the best glue ever. You don't have to use too much if you have small things. All right, I do have this big stick. I kind of want to make it on top. I'm going to put it on top. Oh, I changed my mind. I think I want to put these on top. Look, looks like a little fort. Or maybe it looks like a beach umbrella on an island. Here's the water, there's the island. Ooh, I wish I was at the beach right now. Soon, this summer, this summer we will go to the beach. Okay, now I'm gonna put my tree branch on top of that. Maybe yours is tall, like mine. Whoa. I have to hold that a little bit. Hmm, I think I need more glue. 
It's tricky sometimes. Don't make yours the same as mine. Make yours yours. It's fun to do it your own way. Okay, let me see if I can get my stick to stick on top. This stick is not happy over here. All right, I went too high. Would Pete the cat cry about that? Goodness, no. I think I'm gonna change my plan. I'm gonna put the stick across. There we go. All right. Stick this in here. Oh, if you hear somebody drinking, that's Murph Dog. He just walked in the doggy door and he is a noisy drinker. Okay, maybe I'll glue. Hi, Murph Dog. Some of my silver paper on there. Like that. I have my rocks inside my lids. I don't know. You can just keep building and building and building. And when it's done, maybe mom and dad can carefully pick it up and display it. All right? So have fun building with your Play-Doh. There's Murph Dog. Murph Dog, what are you doing? He wants to come build. So I'm going to say goodbye. You guys have fun. If you build something amazing, send me a picture. All right? I love you guys.